What is the difference between index mutual funds and ETFs? Remember, index funds are basically mutual funds that try to track or get the same return as the index. ETFs also track indices. So what's the difference? The index fund mutual fund manager has to buy all the stocks in the index the day after you invest. The delay and quantum of buying means that she buys it at a slightly higher price. She also needs to hold some cash to allow investors to redeem on a daily basis. Hence, the fund performance doesn't quite track. It has a small tracking error. Now imagine the index fund itself gets listed on the stock exchange. This means the investors can buy and sell on the exchange. Hence, the name exchange traded fund. So the fund does not need to keep any cash. The result, the performance of the ETF shows a lower tracking error than the index fund. If you are worried that your ETF might not be liquid enough when you need to buy or sell, don't worry. The ETF ecosystem includes market makers who can buy and sell the fund to you to ensure liquidity. And if the volume is really big, there are also authorized participants who can do in-specie trades, which means that they can compile baskets of shares and trade them for ETF units with the AMC. This way, the ETF price doesn't show too much premium or discount to the underlying NAV. So next time somebody tells you that ETFs are no good, that they're not liquid enough or something is the matter with them, don't listen to them. Or come and ask me. Just put a question below. <laughs>